What's up everyone, Crito here, and I've been seeing a lot of videos on how to level up characters and how to gain a bunch of money, uh, and it's always use this specific character and do this specific thing, uh, and I found a way to do that without having anything at all. You don't have to uh, have the right mods, you don't have to have the right character, you don't have to have anything at all, uh, and it's basically just an unlimited loot farm that you can do over and over and over. Uh, so I'm gonna show you right here, this is my level one Glay. I have zero mods on her, no mods here. Uh, she is level one. And then I have a tamer here with zero mods on it as well, okay? So this is just a level 100 tamer. So once you get to hard mode, anybody can do this. It is easier if you put mods on, which I'll show you in a minute. Uh, but then you're gonna come down here to the mountains in White Knight Gulch, and you're gonna run over here to this reactor, or sorry, this outpost that's over here. Uh, so we're gonna run down here. And what makes this so good is there's a ledge which will force all of the enemies to go to the exact same location. Um, so you can do this on literally any level character. You do need a high level weapon because you're gonna need to be able to do damage, but you don't need to mod it or anything. I would recommend modding it if you can. I would recommend modding your character if you can, but I'm gonna show you that you don't have to have that. You can see my character only has 3,200 health. Uh, and then we have that unmodded, um, tamer so we're going to come right over here this is the ledge i was talking about so enemies can't come from behind you they can only come from this little hole right here so what you do is you just kind of poke your head out you shoot a couple of them and then you can stand right back here and you can just mow them down and it's extremely safe uh when you're doing this unmodded you want to stand back here like this you don't want to get too close uh, but you can see that it'll reset and then you can immediately start it up again so you can sit here and do this for as long as you want. Uh, I mean, if you if you don't want to reset it, you want to get more enemies, you just go a little bit closer to the wall and you can keep doing this for a full 60 seconds if you want to. Uh, the problem is, obviously, if you have low health, you could get too many enemies and you could die like this, okay? So you want to be able to build up to that. So what I do recommend is uh, going ahead and modding up your character a little bit and just put in the HP mod. So we're going to do HP uh, and we're going to put in increase the maximum increase HP. I put in uh, stem uh, accelerant and then max distribution. This is gonna give me 500% more health. So I'm currently level two and this is 500% more health right here, uh, which is going to give me, let's see how much health that gives me, 19,000 health by maxing out those at level two, brand new fresh level two character. Uh, currently I have 3,100 because it doesn't fix that. But if we come back here and we just get a few of the enemies to come around the corner, like we just did a second ago. Um, we'll start getting some health drops and then hopefully heal up before we start taking too much damage. Sometimes you don't, sometimes you do. You do want to have, you know, as much health as you can. There we go. We got a couple health drops. And then that's it. I mean, you can just sit here and mow down enemies all day as they come around that corner there. And you're going to just pick up the health drops. You're healing up. You're also getting money you're getting xp uh, you can see my xp bar up there moving fairly quickly and you never really run out of ammo because eventually one of these will drop ammo sometimes I, I have run out of ammo before but it's it's pretty rare you know that you don't get enough ammo because these enemies are literally right on top of you when they come around the corner and you can just sit here and do this uh, we'll wait till the timer is up timer is now up and we can look at the results. I mean, it's not going to be amazing amounts of money, but I got 20,000 gold in one minute right there. We got 600 Kuiper and we got lots of XP and we got some items and we didn't even pick up all the gold and items because we can actually run in here and pick up more gold and items that we missed during that. So you, every once in a while, just run in, grab everything, and then you can run right back out and jump over that ledge right here and just wait for the enemies to come and get you and boom, you sit here and mow them down some more. Extremely safe. Uh, you don't have to worry about anything. I mean, one of the easiest farms I've found in the game. It, and you don't you don't need to have high-level characters. You don't need to have high-level anything. You, you literally can just do this uh, as a level one character like I showed you. I would, however, recommend the HP mods. Anyway, hopefully you like this video. If you did, please like, subscribe, follow, all those kind of things. It does help me out quite a bit. And come on over to the Twitch channel, and, uh, you know, we'll find some more tips and tricks for you. Thank you for watching. See you next time. Bye.